Hello, I'm Lawrence Anthony, and I'd like to talk today about the AntConc File View tool. I'll be going through some of the basic features of this tool. Okay, so first I'm going to load in a corpus as I've done for other tutorials. So I go to Open Files and select my corpus, which is 12 texts from uh, a communications uh, communication textbook. So I'll open that, and now uh, if we move the cursor over one of the files, we'll see the uh, finger appear over the uh, file name. And so if we click on that now, we can see the file. And if we click on another file, we'll see it in the main display, like so. Okay, so we can view files um, this way, which is very convenient. Uh, we can also search uh, within a file, as we've done before in the concordance tool and the concordance plot tool. So for example, if I search for work as we've been doing before and click start, we see there's actually no hits here for work. But if we search for something like and, which is a very common word and click start again, we'll see that we have now 14 hits and they're scattered through the text as you can see here. And if you want, you can jump through each hit by clicking on the hit location down button and we go down through the hits and we can go back up through the hits too. And this allows us to do searching within the uh, file view. So I can now, for example, investigate the word tornado and hit that. And we can see that in this text, there's actually 12 hits for a tornado because this is a text about tornadoes. We can also do uh, uh, wildcard searches. For example, I can do dis and we get discovered. I can type P and we can get people. And we can do uh, searches, for example, had star that. And now we, had, we have had discovered that uh, as an example of a wildcard. As before, we can also use the advanced search. So I can go to advanced search and here I can uh, add different words uh, through uh, to a file, or I can use context words as before. So for example, I may want to look for words, uh, for example, uh, sound, having a word which, with sound appearing three words to the left or three words to the right of it. So I'll use context words and horizons. And now if I search for anything, I actually find um, anything that's near the word sound, as you can see here. Sound is quite a common word in this text. So I can also, for example, now find tornado in the vicinity of sound. And we can see here tornado sound like this. And there's one other hit which is new tornado sound, like that. So that's basically the features of the file view tool. Of course, if we move over one of the hits here and we get the little finger appearing, and if we click on that, we then go back to the concordance tool and we can find uh, hits there. And of course, we also get the same results in the plot tool. And if we click on one of those, we jump back to where that word appeared in the original file view. So you can see how all the uh, tools are linked together. And in fact, the file view tool is uh, kind of a central tool for the whole of this system, uh, allowing you to see the context of the searches. So that's file view. Thank you.